Welcome to Apple Reviews, the show that reviews apples. Today we have an apple that we hyped up last time as being in a regular shape. So let's dish out the apple. Apple Master Chef, give us the apple. What's the apple? What's the social security number? What's the apple? So this apple is known as the Mutsu apple or the Crispin apple. It was introduced in 1949 and was developed in Japan. It is a mix between the Golden Delicious and the Indo Apple. What do you guys think about the color? It's both red and green, so I'm expecting it's probably going to be somewhere between tart and sour. It has freckles kind of spots. That's fascinating. How does the skin suppose. feel? Uh, actually, you know, it, it feels fine. It feels, yeah, it feels smooth, so it's, it's not really it's notable. Not be, yeah. Well, I think it's gonna. we're going to have to do the break test first to find out right. whether this yeah. apple's going to get stuck in your teeth, but so far, so good. I'm All right. curious what it'll, what it'll taste like. Yeah, I am too. Let's do the knock test before we cut this apple up and consume it. Uh, it's a little weak. kind of feels like I'm bruising it. It does, yeah, it does feel a little weak, so no. maybe that skin's going to be a little mushy. I mean, a super hard apple isn't necessarily good, but... All right, we're going to cut this apple up and then give our review. You want to do the break test? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's let's dive in in just three, two... Sorry. Okay. You know, I counted down, so... <laughs> that was a, a oh, wow. relatively good break. This skin is very thin. It turns out Apple Master Seth was not lying. Yeah, you uh, can really It's see almost it. transparent. I'm... I'm a little worried this is gonna get stuck in my teeth. I really hate that. <laughs> that really makes an apple bad. You say that every time. So, what do you guys think about how this apple smells? You're like, I smell a little bit of sweetness. Um, it's I hard to tell. I really yeah. don't like the way it smells. Honestly, really? if you yeah. made this into a candle, I wouldn't buy it. Okay. okay. Well, let's let's lick it. You know, let's the lick test. There's not much there. Not much there. Wow, yeah. really I think we're gonna there. have to eat this, boys. All right. I'm not getting much. Three. Let's go. Oh no. <laughs> this is giving me nightmares. It reminds me of the Red Delicious. You guys get that too? I don't know. Mm -mm. What? It's not as crispy mm -mm. as I would have liked it to be. Despite that uh, that break test, what it sounded like, I thought it was going to be rather crisp, but this is a bit mushier than I expected. Yeah, I didn't see the resemblance to the Red Delicious. It's not the taste, it's the texture. The texture is like the Red Delicious. It feels like when, yeah. you, when you take a bite into it, the your whole mouth feels different. Yeah, it's not like, good. Like, hard. Like, your teeth feels hard suddenly. The texture's not very good on this apple. Yeah. I do like the taste, though. Um, so, for me, it's kind of difficult to say where I'd place it. Um, but, if I had to give it an apple score, which I do because we're on Apple Reviews, the only show on YouTube that gives Apple Reviews, Apple scores on an A to Z scale to all the apples in the world. It's our never-ending quest to review every apple. Yeah. If I had to give this apple a score, I'd probably give it a, a probably a P. Uh, I don't know. Wow. wow. It, the it's harsh. harsh. I know, but it's just not that good. I I don't know. I like, agree with Chris here. If, if I on the A to Z scale, I don't, I would honestly give it a. An N. I think it's rather mediocre. It's middle of the road, yeah. in my opinion. It's not that good. You know, uh, I think I'm going to have to agree with Chris on this one. This is definitely a P. I think Joe is being too generous. I think we can say that. I think Joe maybe thinks this apple is better than it is. Um, but it's just, a, it's, it's like a safe apple, but it's not a good apple, right? Mm -hmm. it's, not, it's not an apple that you're going to go out of your way to go eat. You're not going to go say, say to your friends, go buy this apple. Yeah. Thanks for watching Apple Reviews, guys. Tune in next time for the apple that refuses to be browned or cooked. Yeah. So with... <laughs> Uh, thanks for watching Apple Reviews. Tune in next time. <laughs>